a huge win last week. Uh, probably a lot of emotion going into that game against a team that's considered to be one of the best in the conference. How do you take that and carry it into the new week against South Alabama instead of keeping your heads on the big win on Saturday? Uh, we, we knew it was going to be a, a tough game. Uh, so we, went, we was preparing for that, you know what I'm saying, the whole ball week going into practice. Um, and it came down to the final possession. Shai, you guys have been able to say the past couple of years just about nobody believes in this, nobody believes in this. Yeah. This year, this week, you're a favorite. And that's rare. Yeah. How do you go in with that as opposed to having a chip on your shoulder? Well, well, I feel like we still need to have that tip on our shoulder. I know me personally, you know what I'm saying, I, I still got it on mine. Um, you know, I, I, I never really felt like I got a, I had anything to prove to no one, you know what I'm saying, but just going out there and competing, you know what I'm saying, winning, you know what I'm saying, it feels good and we want to continue that, you know what I'm saying, we don't want to get complacent, you know what I'm saying, yeah, we, we started off hot, you know what I'm saying, we got to continue that. What's the message like coming from the coaches of kind of trying to, to preach that, of not getting complacent, yeah. not you know, just sitting there and liking the fact that you're favored in this game, how do they keep stoking that fire and keep everybody growing? Uh, just just continue to do what, we, what got us there. Um, you know what I'm saying? Blue collar, you know what I'm saying? And playing discipline. And that's what got us this far, and that's what's going to continue to win us games. What do you expect out of South Alabama? Uh, they're looking for revenge. Um, last year, you know what I'm saying? That was one of our first wins, um, 52 to 0. So it was kind of, you know what I'm saying? It was kind of embarrassing for them. Um, so they gon they gonna come in here, you know what I'm saying, with a chip on their shoulder, and they gonna be we gonna get their best game as as we as we should, you know what I'm saying. And we gonna be ready, we gonna prepare this week, and you know what I'm saying we gonna put on the show Saturday. Obviously, you always believed in this team because yeah. brothers believe in each other. But was there, and it's not a mountaintop, it's one win. But yeah. was there a real feeling of validation Saturday night that hey, we can accomplish what I think we can accomplish? Oh, for sure, definitely. Um, you know, like y'all said, they they predict, they they was predicted to win the Sun Belt. Um, and you know, what I'm saying we we seen that we we knew that. Um, but uh, they didn't they didn't stop us from preparing how we usually prepare. And we were not there Saturday, and, and we and we we fought hard, and that's what we're gonna continue to do for from here on out. Um, but yeah, it felt good to to beat one of the top two teams in this conference. Sean, the playbook seems to be opening up a little more week to week. Do you see that, and do you feel like? There's even a lot more that you guys can do offensively? Uh, of course, um, because they allow um, what well, it makes the defense uh, have to defend more stuff. Um, so it's definitely in our advantage to, to have the, the amount of plays that we have going there. Do you feel like it's, it's expanding? Because it looked like you guys used some formations that you haven't used all year. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. It, it's definitely helping, um, and it's definitely expanding. And hopefully, you know what I'm saying, we can't week out here to get even bigger and bigger to to expand our playbook. What's the vibe like? What's the what's the atmosphere? What's the mindset? I mean, we see around the fan base, but you guys downstairs, you know, right now after that kind of win and now yeah. moving forward, knowing there's a lot of work still to be done, but you got to be feeling good about where you are. Oh, definitely. We definitely feel good where we're at right now, um, but we still hungry. We still want more. You know what I'm saying? We ain't really accomplished nothing yet besides, the, you know what I'm saying, the wins. We still chasing that, that bowl game, that conference championship. Y'all scored 10 touchdowns and 12 trips in the red zone. It's one of the best marks in the Sun Belt. What's made y'all so good once you get into the red area and putting six points on the scoreboard? Uh, this one. It starts up front. You know what I'm saying? Them boys will, will get it started. Um, and we just go out there and execute, you know what I'm saying? And, and that's what this offense is built on, uh, just, just playing discipline and precision.